Good morning, it's Margaret Fetty at the University of Sewing and it's Facebook Live, guys. All right, so we have a giveaway. I have, I have I it love, actually in my hands. <laughs> this is a lovely giveaway, folks. This is a lovely giveaway. So there is this precious little beaded creation in a thimble set on a button. So it's just tiny and precious. And then we have the scrap box squares from Franklin Quilt Company as a cube pattern that will be perfect to use up with any of your uh, jelly rolls, your five inch squares. You can oh, these use two and a half. Yeah, pre all the pre cuts will work with this. So this is really cool. So that is our giveaway today. And you need to. Um, it, Pat's here with me. Thank you, Pat, for hanging out with me. I'm so Hello, appreciative. Everyone. So Pat's here with me, and she's going to explain how you could win this. So to win this wonderful gift, all you need to do is, on while you're on watching us on Facebook Live, you have 24 hours, is to comment, say I shared, but first you need to hit that share button, and then tell us that you shared so that we know, and we were going to put your name in a basket, and we're going to draw it out. And if you win it, we will either ship to better yet, we ask that you come in and pick it up. If it's possible for you to come in and pick it up, we'd love that because we love seeing our oh, customers. customers. It's so great. much fun. Okay, guys, check out what we're in front of. So Dave is showing you right now the beautiful Bloomsville Tilda line. Uh, this is their trunk show that they have loaned us for just two weeks. If you have the opportunity to come in and see it in person, the quilting is outstanding. They are really, really lovely. Um, these, everything is pieced perfectly. Everything is quilted perfectly. Oh my goodness. It's just an absolutely gorgeous group of quilts. And I think that there is uh, a new Tilda idea in the works here for some of you after you see this. So, wanted to let you know we have multiple Tilda kits available. We go ahead and uh, print out the pattern for you. Uh, remember that whenever we put a tilde kit together, because tilde moves really fast, we don't necessarily have the exact fabrics that are in the original quilts, but we put together a gorgeous group of tilde fabrics for you, and we make them into these kits. We've also got two hometown layer cakes still available. And guys, these are just stunning. That whole group of hometown was just such a pretty line. It's very rare to find any of these fabrics still available. So having these layer cakes is really special. We have a bunch of, um, we have chambray bundles. We have their chambray dots bundle. We have some floral bundles, and we also have a group of both the cool and the warm solids available for you to get. So there is a lot here. Um, this isn't all we have, but this is kind of where we've got it at right now. We also have multiple uh, tilde books. So if you've never, if you're seeing this fabric for the first time, you're kind of surprised at how gorgeous it is. It's even better in person, I'm just going to tell you. It is an amazing group of fabrics, and we have quite a bit of them available. So if you go onto our website at universityofsewing.com and put in Tilda, you'll see all these different fabrics that we have. And it's going to be really neat to see the different quilts. I've already had a couple of customers who've shown me quilts they've made from the Tilda fabric. Oh, the Everybody's been just absolutely just loving these lines. In October, we will be getting hibernation. Oh, yeah. So nice. that one has little animals in it, and it's very, very pretty. So I'm really excited about that line. So that we will be getting in October, but you might want to go ahead and get the Bloomsville while they're still available. So they have some gorgeous big prints. They have a lot of smaller, uh, more generally small size blender type of things. So she always does a really good job with this. So that's pretty amazing. Oh, whose is this? 
Well, what is this? What is this? This is a 790 Pro, and it's going to go home with one of our lovely customers. That will be great. She is a little jealous. She's she's so excited. <laughs> I'm so happy for her. Everybody who has gotten one has been so incredibly happy. Oh yes. And it has been a lot of fun. So uh, I'll tell you what. I'm jealous because I want one. <laughs> yeah. so. If you haven't seen this machine working, you need to come in and see it. Try it out. It is a wonderful machine. Has so many extras. The laser light is just my favorite, yes. but the self-threading, oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> I don't have to put my glasses on for everything. Isn't that just the it's best? It's just wonderful. So, so absolutely wonderful. So we will be happy to help her get this loaded up in her car today. All right, guys, we're going to come in here to go ahead and show you I, if you saw the little preview on Facebook, you saw that there's some really pretty fabrics. And I thought I would start off. You're gonna, we've got fabrics that just came in from Michael Miller. We've got fabrics from Robert Kaufman. We've got fabrics from blank. We have got fabrics from... What's the name? Benetex. Benetex. Yeah. Benetex. We have new the new Amanda Murphy line, Botanicals. So... Okay, so let's start off with the Michael Miller because everybody, after seeing that pretty little ad that, that our wonderful marketing team put together, I'm going to, if you don't mind, will you grab that side and I'll grab this and then Dave can show this fabulous panel. This is, um, the panel is called, oh shoot, we'll always have Paris, really beautiful very fabulous. You know, we had an event this past week where we had a wonderful woman uh, came from the southern part of the state. She came up to ha have a uh, apron. Uh, she, she was talking about aprons and the history of them and all the wonderful things that we have in our memories about aprons. And she had stuff from her grandma and her mom. And it was oh. really fabulous. And she suggested using this panel for an apron, it would be really cute. Then what you could do, you know, the, if you just use the Paris part on that, just for the bib Friendly. part, oh, yeah. and then use some of these wonderful fabrics to go with it. So we've got this great fabric. Um, there's one here with writing and bicycles and some of the beautiful buildings in Paris, and of course, roses everywhere. This wonderful abstract kind of blender that is going to make it really work well. Your baseline fabric color here is white. And so you'll be able to do something very bright and modern looking with it. There's gorgeous florals here. There's two different ones, one with a darker background and one with a lighter background. And so this is going to be, somebody's going to do something really lovely with this. And I'm guessing we can either find a beautiful green or a purple to go with this and make up a really pretty quilt. So that is, that is the uh, new group of fabrics we have just gotten in from Michael Miller. All right, we're going to start off with sparkle. I am oftentimes a little bit hesitant to get sparkle. But these are so pretty. Nothing is coming off of them. You aren't, you know, once upon a time, we'd go get sparkle at the quilt store and we'd come home and have it everywhere. That's not true anymore. They've come up with some sort of method to make these glitter a little bit, but no, nothing comes off of the fabrics. So this is a Robert Kaufman line. And this one is um, Julie Boulet. <laughs> I think that's how it's pronounced. And so these beautiful fabrics right here, I didn't get all of them, but I got a nice selection of them. We've got some champagnes with a little bit of black in it. Then I had some black and I had the champagne. I got some beautiful reds and then they have some gold to them. Then we have our beautiful uh, blues here purple and a fantastic teal. That teal is really pretty. And that teal is also in this blue one right here. So that was kind of fun. All right. So 
Amanda Murphy came out with a line. It's called Botanical or Botan Botanica Flowerette. It looks like Botanica. I bet it's but just Botanica is the line. So Botanica's right here, but I only got the black, gray, white colorway because there was like 45 pieces to this, guys, and we just don't have enough room for everything. But I thought this, we've, we've uh, not had really much come in in blacks and whites recently, so I thought that we would kind of make a effort to get some more of those in the shop, and this line made me want to do it. This it is, is really, line. really gorgeous. There are line drawing florals. There are shaded gray and white florals. There's some great geometrics. There are some beautiful abstract kind of uh, very modern looking some of the prints in here. Um, these, these particular geometrics I thought were really lovely. So they're going to be, I think, really quite useful for a lot of people. And then you have to throw in some words from time to time. It really is fun to do. So we've got that in a white on white, a black and white, and a gray with a darker gray background. How cool is that? So you've got all the different colorways that will work. Um, so this line, I think, is going to be a really fun line for you to add into a different a variety of different quilts. But this... Uh, there's some really great pictures, and I, and I will try to add them to this line on uh, the website where you can see some of the quilts that Amanda Murphy designed using these fabrics because they that were really great. special. They're really, really nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to go back over here, and we're going to revisit a line that I decided that we were going to get the entire thing because I really did feel like... This particular line, it is Sienna. Sienna is these little flower, well, I don't know, they're not really flowers. Really, they're mostly leaves. They're just a bunch of leaves and it's got some really interesting things going on with it, but they really are blenders. They are like the blenders. perfect blenders. And we're going to have the entire line. So this is the second installment. We already showed off some of these a couple, oh, probably actually about a month ago. I separated out getting these by a month at a time. So it, because it was just so much to get at one time. But these are lovely. And I'll tell you what, we've already almost sold out of several of the other colorways. We've got these now. These are kind of our yellows through to our browns. Very nice bunch of different things in here. This is from Robert Kaufman. The fabric feels wonderful. I think you're really going to like it. Very beautiful. So um, if you're looking for something to go with one of your fabrics and you like this line, this would be a good time to go ahead and, you know, you can give us a call we can put the colors together that we're thinking that we're gonna actually work and go together, and we can send you a picture. I've done this for several of our customers where they've been like, Margaret, I think that this is what I want, but can you put this fabric and this fabric together, and are they actually gonna be the ones that really work for my quilt or for whatever project you're doing? And that is a fantastic way for you to make sure that you're happy with the colorways. So, seeing is believing. Seeing is believing. Remember last week when I showed you those wonderful hexi fabrics? Very bright, very kind of rainbow colors. They're very pretty. Check out these guys. I think this group of fabrics I got, there's just a few of them, but they just go so well with hexi. These are some wonderful rainbow prints, very fun. I am thinking that there is some kids in my world that I'm gonna make some really fun quilts for. So I love this ombre kind of rainbow type of thing going on. We've got this wonderful print right here, but 
This one's kind of a little bit of an outlier, but it's an outlier in a good way. Finding stars on fabric that are sophisticated and not kind of just, boy, you know, there's so many companies that just have really just not very attractive star fabric. It's kind of sad. <laughs> I'm not sure what it's about, but I get really frustrated because mm -hmm. I look for good star fabric and I'm just like, there's so few of them out there. This is going to work for Christmas. This is going to work for a night sky. This is going to Fourth work July, for too. your 4th of July, red, white, and blue, your quilts of valor, all of those. It is going to work for those because it is just so beautiful. Can I tell you what I like the best about this fabric? What's that, Pat? Is the fact that the stars are not big stars. Right, right. They, they can go with so many other things. Uh-huh. I agree. I agree. I love the size of the stars. They're very tiny. Um, they're just about the size of one of those yellow-headed pins. Yes. So that's about the size of the stars. They This just such a good fabric for so many different things. And I will tell you, my experience with our good star fabric is it goes like that. Mm -hmm. So if you like this, if you think it's something that's going to work for one of your projects, I'd order it soon because what happens is somebody will come in and they'll be like, Margaret, that's just fabulous fabric. And they buy five yards, you know, because yeah. that, that's what they do. And we have a great group of people here in Indiana that um, I see from time to time. They're really involved with the Quilts of Valor. And I'm going to guess that this is really going to speak to them. So it will. we it's... will probably see some of this going out quickly because of that. It's really fabulous fabric. So, I'm going to remind you about today's giveaway for Facebook Live. It is this beautiful beaded thimble and this pre-cut design of a quilt that you can make. And we ask you that you just share. And we ask that you comment that we know that you shared. And we will put your name and we will draw. You have 24 hours while you're watching this to get our, your name in. And we'll check it out on Monday and Tuesday and see where we're at. And we will give send this to you or we will most likely would love to see you come in and we'd love to uh, visit with you for a while and see what else you might enjoy at the shop. Oh, by the way, in case you haven't been here, it is changing big time. We have got a whole bunch of things that we're going to be unveiling probably next week for Facebook Live. But um, we're going to just have to be patient, see how far Dave and, and our trusty helpers are going to get along with this. But I want to make sure that everybody knows what's coming up for the next couple weeks because we've got a number of things going on. One, the sale Bernina trade-in sale. If you're ready to get into a Bernina, there's a 25% trade-in sale. So whatever Bernina you want to buy, if you bring me in a sewing machine, and you want to buy a long arm, you want to buy a serger, or you want to buy a sewing machine, you will be able to get that for 25% off its normal price. So that's pretty amazing. The normal prices are on our website, so you can see them right up and straight up in front of you. And then you just take and do the little calculator, Multiply it by 0.75 and you'll figure out exactly how much that machine will be. Now, of course, there's always sales tax. We can't get around that. But what I want to make sure you know is that we have got this wonderful sale going on. And if you thought that you couldn't afford to get into a Bernina, you can get into this a Bernina. This is the time. It is a wonderful time. And also, if you've been thinking that, you know, maybe you want to upgrade to one of the nicer Berninas, We've got some amazing prices on the 790 plus. We've got amazing prices on a used 880. We've got it right here and out on the floor. And we've actually got some other things here available for you. So don't hesitate, come on in, get a demo. Make sure you see these machines because this sale is gonna end on, set on October the 1st. So the other thing we've got coming up is the Run Run Rudolph sale. Uh, yes. Or Run Run Rudolph. Yeah. It's the Shop Hop. Shop Hop coming up. Have you signed up for it yet? Have you gotten your passport yet? Well, if you're a little bit far away and you need us to, 
you can still buy it from us and we can mail it to you. We don't mind doing that. So if you want to buy one and you don't have time to come in right now, please just give us a quick call this morning. We'll get your information and we will ship you your charm and your passport. And then we will see you for that. And that is the last weekend of September. Mm -hmm. So that's going on. Um, what about their classes? Look at how the classroom has changed. Mm -hmm. The classroom has gotten, right now we've got a little bit of fabric in it. We're gonna be <laughs> moving that pretty soon. It'll be out of the classroom in a few, just very short period of time, but we have now so much more space. And did you know who is gonna come back to the University of Sewing? No. Whitney from Tomcat, Tomcat Stitchery, Stitchery is gonna be coming back. Now, I can't share with you all the details because I got to leave it for her to be able to do. But if you like to watch Whitney, and I know many of you do, then make sure that you keep an eye out for that because she's coming back in October. And so we're really excited to have her back. And so when she comes back, guess what is coming in the mail to us right now, guys? I have no idea. We have a whole new group of stoff knits coming in. Oh, yes. <laughs> so our cute little tops that we like to make with our L890 serger. Mm -hmm. And I was going to wear one of them today, and I realized when I put it on, it was too big. Mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm pretty excited. I didn't know I was really changing. I, I've, been, I've been working on it. I've been working on it. So apparently I need to take a little bit of that sweatshirt. I would, it was really cold this morning. Uh -huh. I mean, I can't believe it's in the mid-50s. What is this? We're only into mid-September. It's yeah. not supposed to be that cold yet. Not in the morning. So anyway, we have all these things going on. And we can't wait to share all of it with you. So... What Pat was suggesting is we've got a bunch of classes coming up. Take a look at the classes, see if there's something for you. And we're always adding more, getting ready to do another whole group of them. We try to keep up with all of this, but boy, so much to do. There's a lot so much going to on. do. So there's a lot going on. But I think by the time we hit the beginning of October, we're going to be in our stride. And we're going to have a coat class. Have you signed up for the coat class? That's in October. It is in October. Let's go over here real quick and let me show you the coat that we're going to be making. Oh, October, we also are having an apron class. So if you wanted to make an apron, this class is for anybody. It does say it's a beginner class, but the fact of the matter is it's for anybody that wants to get that apron done. <laughs> <laughs> so, if you have a problem getting your projects finished, that'd be a great place to start. So, for the month of October, the Fridays of October, we are doing a code class. It is using this gorgeous pattern called the Step Ahead Jacket. It is uh, one of CNT's patterns, and this this particular jacket I made as a sample. The jacket is unlined. I didn't know, I didn't finish it yet, guys, because I want to show people. I had something happen with the jacket, and I wanted to show people how to, to work with that. And so this beautiful jacket, we have this wool available. And the wool is still here in the shop. The jacket is unlined. So it's a very approachable jacket. It's not hard to make. It's also not a super... At, without the lining, it's not a super hot jacket. So if you tend to be warm natured, this might be the perfect solution for you for that. But if you want, we are going to have plenty of time in this class for those of you who are a little bit more experienced sewers to go ahead and show you how you could put a lining in this. It's not hard. So everybody... We need to get you signed up for this because there's only a limited amount of spaces. I've really made this a small class. You'll get a lot of individualized attention. It's really quite something. And that is, it's going to be a lot of fun. So I hope you will decide that this is something. We also have in our shop right now about, I want to say 15 different coating wools. Okay. At least 15 of them. So there's a lot here. One of the coating wools we have is this beautiful red. 
So this was using a Vogue pattern, 8930. And what I did with this is I put these really fun pockets on it. These were not the pockets in the pattern. The pockets on the pattern showed these really dumb little pockets. <laughs> they were dumb. They were just so little. Um, you can I lose things in this pocket, though. Well, it's maybe, but you know what? I wear a hat and gloves in the winter time, mm -hmm. so I wanted it to be big enough, and I also wanted it to be big enough to show off my pretty embroidery. So I made the Great pocket. Great job, Margaret. I, I'm going to put snaps on here so that they stay. You know, so I'm going to put two snaps on it. Hold that closed, so when I'm actually wearing it, they don't just pop open. So that's going to be the next. Last thing that I'm gonna do with that one. So, thinking about getting cold and whether or not you need something warm, don't forget we have these beautiful Bernina fleece lap quilt. We've got the kits, we've got the fabric. It is ready to walk out the door. Um, this fabric goes pretty fast. I would go ahead and order. This fleece is not always available, so make sure that you order some. And I know you have a Bernina lover in your world, if even if it's just you. And this would be great to have in your... <laughs> I, I'm going to just put it on my chair at home and just anybody ask me about it, I'm going to be like, well, that's because I love my Berninas. <laughs> so, okay, everybody. We are getting to the point where the shop has to open, which means I should probably get going. It's that time. It is that time. And I hope all of you have a fantastic Saturday and keep tuning in for our Facebook lives. We love having you. Please share it with your friends. That's how we get new customers. That's how we keep growing. You guys have been just so fabulous to us and we're very grateful. Don't forget, we've got these cute, this is, yes, this is one free gift that you can get by sharing and getting your name entered into the drawing. So we've got this cute pattern and this lovely little beaded uh, tchotchke, little, little decoration. decoration, little decoration, perfect for your sewing room. So we hope that you will join us next Friday for Facebook Live and we'll see you then. Have a good day.